What's up guys, I'm Chris Doughty, aka Doughtonator. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this video, we're gonna help you to win on Special Stage Route X, the most meme of all races in Gran Turismo Sport. Um, on pole for this race, um, uh, electric truck, the driver recognized me from my channel and um, said he enjoyed the content. So uh, great to see drivers out there on the track uh, who watch my videos. And we're going to get straight away with the first tip for winning a special stage Route X. And that is do a qualifying lap. In fact, do two qualifying laps because your first qualifying lap um, across the line, you won't carry the speed. Uh, you'll be about two seconds down. So do two qualifying laps. Um, the trick for the qualifying lap is to run the high line. Just watch the top 10 uh, ghost, follow the ghost, use his lines, and it's going to get you towards the front of the grid. Now, some say it's a drafting race, you, you don't need to qualify, but look at the way the cars are on the track right now. They're all in a line. Without anybody to work with, um, you're not getting to the front of the field. So we're going to qualify in second position. Uh, we're going to get in that slipstream. And actually, in this race, this is my first race of the night. It was a mad Monday at the time. Uh, we're going to decide to uh, spice things up a bit, uh, break the train and go for it. Hopefully someone's going to come with us and we're going to hopefully get a train to overtake electric truck. But we're going to go three wide, it seems. But now we've found some boost from the driver behind us and he's, he's going to work with us. So um, tip number two is to um, work with the longest train. Um, what I did in this particular race, uh, I don't think that was the best thing to do. Um, sent, luckily for me, it, it did work out. But basically you want to be uh, riding near the front um, and get yourself into the longest train and as long as there aren't any other breakaway trains that are long enough then they're not going to be able to come back at you so uh, my third tip I'm not going to lose count of uh, tips in this one um, is to use the tighter line in the race uh, for qualifying the fastest way around the track uh, is on the high line uh, on the very outside line uh, run that uh, it gives you the fastest exit speed from the corners and it basically gives you the most speed down the straights. Now, in this particular race, if you look on the radar, complete ace combat there, everybody's passing to the inside. So in the race, the high line doesn't really work um, because you, you're getting slipstream from the other cars for the straights um, and you don't need to carry it. So qualifying and racing is completely separate driving lines. For qualifying, use the high line. For the race, um, keep on the low line. Don't let anybody get to your inside and force the cars behind you to, to bump you around the corner so you see here we get a little bit stranded um the the longest train has become to the inside we're completely stranded there's no way across to really join that train we're going to try and filter in just behind this norwegian driver i think that's norwegian flag let me know in the comments below if it is or if it isn't um, but now we are back in the fast train and the problem now we're running in sixth position um, if you do want to get faster in GT Sport, uh, join the Race Asylum Discord in the uh, comments, no, the comments, the description below. Uh, there'll be a link to that. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you're enjoying these meme races. Uh, have you tried it this week um, and how did you get on? So we're going to look to the inside. Hopefully someone behind us wants to work with us. Um, but you see, we've just not got the pace. Um, the long train is really dominating. Looks like the Norwegian driver is looking to the inside, maybe. Uh, we're not too far away from uh, the second of the two corners in this race. Um, but yeah, you see that the long train, you just, you just can't beat it when you are um, just stranded on your own. So we shuffle right down the pack to eight, uh, ninth position now. Um, and we're going to go into the corner. So your best bet is to um, really be smooth on the corners. We need to find a uh, slipstream to use and a, a clear path through so we're using the high line again um we're not quite figured out that the the low line is the better one to use but right now we need to be trying to uh, carry our momentum through get a bit of slipstream from each of the drivers as we navigate our way through and we're going to go with a good overspeed to the outside maybe that's going to work for us we've got a bit of overspeed um and we're going to get the slipstream from the south african driver but we, there's nowhere to go so all we can do is bump him to give him the win and we're going to come across the line in third position so uh, not bad from ninth going into the last corner um but as you can see from there we didn't follow our tips and this is the things we learned during uh that last race so right now uh, we're going again electric truck 
Um, he's what we're going to do now uh, as a viewer of the channel we're going to give him, give him uh, viewers priority and we're just going to help him our goal in this particular race uh, is to get electric truck across the line first and um, this is going to show you how much teamwork helps so basically we're following electric truck we're bump drafting the whole way around um, there's no other train that's going to beat us we're going to bump draft around the whole corner now I think electric truck's line was a little bit wide um, but we're going to help him all the way. It gives us a, a flash on the hazards just to thank us for uh, this assistance. Now, can we get electric truck to the line um, to get this win for him? Um, I'm not even going to pass him into the final corner. Um, I want to try and get him across the line. So you see bit like behind, um, without the train breaking into two, nobody's going to get past. Um, but right now, the line that we're taking, in my opinion, it, it's too high. It leaves us exposed to the inside and once someone gets alongside um, it becomes a problem as we see here the the driver in third place just gets into our rear quarter and shuffles us a little bit wide um, and now we, we can't help so the drivers are going to get some over speed to the inside uh, we're still going to get the bump on the electric truck can we give him some that's a huge amount of speed from those two drivers um, and we're going to try and push electric truck as fast as we can but we're not going to get the win passed on the inside in the final corner so um that is tip number four i think it's number four um stay stay tight uh, hopefully the guys behind you will want to work with you um and we're going to go again uh, now check out this lobby this is a full a plus lobby for a daily race meme um and yeah it's absolutely stacked lobby but this wasn't top split uh, basically we're streaming a lot of other fast drivers was um, racing at the time and this is actually second split so there's a whole lobby above this one that is A plus drivers I don't even think my uh, main Daltonator account would have been in top split in this particular race so we're going to go uh, start with traction control um, on one um, another tip tip number five maybe uh, it seems the fastest way to qualify is to put wet tyres on the car. I've not personally tried that, um, but looking at the uh, the ghost for the, the fastest time, it was on wet tyres, so perhaps less rolling resistance, uh, who knows. But in this one, my goal here is to get to the front, stay to the inside, and uh, so the cars ahead, see, they, they've gone for a pass, that's their mistake, and they are they are slow. So I'm going to uh, sack off the slipstream, uh, go for the brake on my own. And luckily we have a big train that's going to go with me. So that is absolutely worked out perfectly. The ancient pleb we've seen before in some FIA races. Um, and those two drivers that were in first and second, they're going to get stranded in their two car train. And my train is about to depart for the win. Let's hope. Um, so yeah, it looks like everybody's decided to follow me. And now I've become the head of uh, this large train. So um, as this race is going to progress, uh, the goal for this one is just to stay in the lead um, and just make sure, just keeping an eye out behind to make sure that there aren't any uh, big trains that are, are going to provide a threat. Um, hopefully that's going to be the case. Tip number six, uh, use your flashes hazards um, just to thank other drivers. Uh, you look, look at that train now that is an absolute perfect line train is that all all 12 cars in line um nobody dare make a move for it oh, someone's going for the move to the inside now the cars are starting to break away um and i'm just going to start to drift over to the inside to make sure i've got the inside for the corner so i was about to say uh, tip number six is communicate with your drivers get on the flashes to thank drivers for bump drafting you down the straight uh, build some relationships some alliances with drivers um, to hopefully get you across the line so yeah my inside train is working out perfectly no one wants to go to the inside you've scrubbed far too much speed um, but I've got a bunch of four or five cars that are backing me as we're going to go uh, back in line again uh, Damien it looks like SCK driver um, has definitely uh, got onto our side now as we're going to go uh, dr drift into the inside again covering off the inside um, I don't want any drivers to get to my inside by the time we get to the corner um, so we're going to be going all the way down this straight here it's it's a long straight as you can imagine um, but just keep checking behind you you've got to be aware what's going on with other drivers 
um, be aware of any threats of any breakaway trains looking to um, get get alongside so it looks like there's a bit of shenanigans going on behind but no real threat no one's really making any big alliances so uh, we are safe now into the final corner in first position probably not the best place to be but i'm going to stay to the inside i don't want to get anybody down my inside and um, the other drivers have got a choice whether to go on the high side um or whether it's to bump me around and go for a uh, a a slipstream to the to the line so we're going to hold that inside line no one's decided to make a break for it yet um, all I can do is just minimize my steering inputs to maximize my speed off the corner and someone is to the inside uh, someone who's directly behind me is going to get some slipstream and they're going to pull to the side drag race to the line and we are going to get it on the line absolutely perfect there perfectly executed race um, and that is 0 0.009 of a second to win by. I hope you enjoyed this race or these races. Um, I hope these tips have helped, are going to help you uh, do this ultimate meme race in GT Sport. Uh, let me know in the comments below how you're getting on and we'll catch you in the next one.